Sadly, 19-year-old Jay Slater is still missing, and while authorities have called off the search for him, his father and brother are walking the mountainous region searching for him. His dad, Warren's legs are visibly scratched from walking among the plants and rough terrain to search for his son. The names Lucy and Brad have come up a lot in this case, maybe it's because they spoke out publicly. Lucy was under scrutiny from the beginning though, since she claimed to have last contact with Jay via phone, as well as set up the GoFundMe for 30000 It made people immediately look at her, and question everything she says and does. Brad spoke out, and recently told the online trolls to shut up. He said they were not some drug mules or whatever people are making them out to be. One friend that we heard less about is Brandon Hodson. 19-year-old, Brandon was in Tenerife with Jay, Lucy and Brad too. He is seen in a number of pictures, and this is a well-known one. He can be seen sitting with his arm around Jay, and Lucy is pictured in the background too. He is wearing a bright orange shirt, with a black bag. Many wanted to know more about Brandon because he hasn't spoken out about the claims that Jay's friends left him alone, and returned to their apartment. Well, in latest news, it seems that Brandon's family have now spoken out, and claim that he has been receiving death threats. Apparently, Brandon partied with Jay just two days before Jay vanished. Brandon's mother, Natalie, said he is being subjected to a hate campaign on social media. She said his treatment was similar to how Nicola Bully's family were treated, and the false rumors that swirled in that case. This interview was done at the family home in Briarfield, Lancashire, and Natalie insisted that her son is helping Spanish police. She said he had no plans to break his silence, and addressed speculation from amateur sleuths on social media following his return home. He is liaising with police and that's all that matters. Jay's father has called on an army for help, after saying that he has received no update from police.